on the internet. Here we go with the wet show today. You guys ready to get wet? No, not ready. It's already raining, actually. Rain or shine. Yeah, I'm gonna go back in here. Rain or shine, baby. No, how much? It's the Miami weather, but you see right behind that cloud, that's Elliot Key, and that's where we're going. So hopefully, we can make it without getting wet over there. And today, we're out of Madison Hammock. And look at that. It's raining like crazy over the city. It's in here. But, all right. Rain or shine. We're here in your hand. So let's go with the show. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna go there. Oh. The new rain runner. I just got <laughs> I just got kicked out, out from under the roof. So I guess I go over here. They kicked me out of the roof. I go over here. See I got a little bit of roof right there. We're coming out of the channel. Out of the channel. And hopefully we could go on the other side of that cloud. That big old cloud right there. See we gotta stay away from there and go that way. And then over there it's raining too. So right at Elliot Key should should be clear. Hopefully. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens, Mike. So today we took a big chance because we left the house and it was raining. And by the time we got to the boat ramp, it was raining there too. We actually had to wait about 20 minutes inside the car until it slowed down, giving us enough time to throw the boat in the water because a little bit of rain doesn't scare us. Plus we got rain runner number two. Plus, we also believe in positive energy, and our energies are focused that today is going to clear up. Just like I figured, the closer we got to Elia Key Sandbar, the more clear skies we saw. And we did get chased by the rain, we actually had to run a little bit north and then back down south to avoid it. Everything up, but you know, we're here and you guys are here, so let's go going show show. <laughs> oh, look at that! We got Pink Panther in the house today, chilling, dealing with them all. We got the Pink Panther today with us. And for those people that didn't see last Friday's video, well, we took you guys fishing and lobstering during the week on a Tuesday. And it was a really scary moment because we ran into three sharks about five feet long. If you guys want to check that video out, I'm going to leave a link on the description below. And 
and we have made it to paradise and now we're gonna tie up to our friends and so far so good no rain at paradise Samba. Bueno, aquí llegamos. We made it. You made it. You made it. Without getting wet, right? Yes. Mira, mira quién está aquí. No, mira quién está aquí. Los mejores de Sobriano Brothers, baby. Mira, mira, no puedes pasar, mira. Qué cosa, qué cosa hay ahí. Yo, mira lo que hay ahí. Ya, ya el día se puso mejor. Tu chicharrón. No importa la bebida, que el día se puso perfecto. ¿Y no se mojaron? Todavía no. ¿No se mojaron? <laughs> oh, water's cold. Oh, 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 Franco in the house! And we'll be ready to get out of So, ya eso es porque le llaman glitter. De hecho, de eso ya yo me acordé aquí. La hermana del amigo de. Oh my god. La hermana del amigo del mulatico lindo. Oh yeah. Sí, pero he's coming, right? Este es todo, mi no se me pide. Pero Joel es talking about when they're going to come. Oh, I think so. I don't know. Oh, okay. Mira, siempre acuerdo de And we're all here to have some fun in the sun or in the rain. El timbero ahora. Llegó la timba, mi hermano.
Y ya se acabó. Y ya se acabó. No gan. Oh, oh. We inflated the liquid hammock and now it's time to play in it. Well, you guys are noticing the sky is getting darker and it looks like no one is noticing but it's not stopping us here and it's sandbar is starting to feel like a giant playground Try something that's really hard to do when you have a big group like this, and that is take pictures. And well, honestly, it wasn't a hard, or maybe it's because it's still early in the day. And well, we went back to the world because all this jumping around and having too much fun made me hungry. So I'm gonna start off the barbecue, but I have a big challenge because the wind picked up. And today we're not using the square one, we're using the round one. And I noticed that this barbecue turns off really easy when there's a lot of wind. And this barbecue does not have a stand. It's made to be put on to the rod holder. So I can't move it nowhere else. So it's gonna make it really hard for me to cook. And also we just noticed that around us, everything is starting to get dark. And hopefully it doesn't rain because if it does, that's gonna turn off the fire too. And today we're having something that Big Mama, Olguita, made really special. It is turkey burgers, but it has cheddar cheese mushrooms and bacon grind up inside and i hope right now we can get the barbecue to work properly and it doesn't shut off because i really want to taste these special made turkey burgers No bread like Oguita. Is it almost done? Bacon, oh, it's Oguita special. It has bacon, mushroom, and cheese. And cheese, and it's turkey burger. Yeah. And the barbecue sucks today. 
Take it forever. I'm gonna have to speak to uh, Magma. Magma. Give, let me get sponsor a uh, barbecue. Cause this one's not working properly. Okay, so we had issues with the barbecue and the wind picked up even harder because it was starting to drizzle. I wasn't gonna stop our barbecue and we came up with an idea. We used the lid cover for our box to cover the wind and the rain so the fire wouldn't turn off because we were determined to cook our amazing turkey burgers. And this is another prime example that I love to say is if there's a will, there's a way. And we were definitely willing to eat Ogita's amazing turkey burgers, so we found a way. Alright, we're, we're doing something special today. Look at that. Turkey burger with french fries, baby. You know, oh, oh. Let me get mine. Can I get mine, please? I don't know. I'll just grab whatever. What are you doing? What are you? Uh, gulping ketchup? And honestly, I don't know which one's better, the hamburger or the party. But I'm gonna give you guys the secret formula for the turkey burger. Well, first of all, you gotta use turkey ground meat, mozzarella cheese, mushrooms, and cooked bacon. And you cut them up in tiny pieces and mix it together with, with the turkey meat. And then you form the hamburger patty. And it tastes so good, you can eat it by itself without buns. But if you wanna get creative, when you place the bun, add a little french fries to it. You'll love it even more. But something I'm not liking right now is the way that the sky keeps getting darker and the clouds are surrounding us so I think pretty soon it's gonna start raining really hard but still that's not gonna stop the party but the video is so you guys are gonna have to come back for part two and see what happens because rain or shine we're here to celebrate Chi's birthday party So keep your eyes open for the notification for part two. And definitely we're going to have some behind the scenes video, but on Patreon. So don't go away because we have more fun to go out in the cloudy sun.